guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to, being to episode 11 of Jujutsu Kaisen. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. There we go, that's better. This man, like, I just, oh my god. <laughs> Look at how excited he is. He's so cute. Oh my god. Well, yeah, but I feel like he's not going to tell you every little bits and pieces of it, you know. Oh, God. Stupid leggings are just all up on my side. Jesus. I mean, you should, but... Oh. That's it? Oh! Well... Damn. Um. Whatever floats your boat, I guess. I don't know. Like, what? Do you, what do you say about someone who technically did not get killed, but he's already <laughs> like, we know he's gonna be fine. Uh. My fucking boobs, like Jesus Christ. That's why sometimes I hate having big boobs, like oh my god, the struggle is fucking real. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> to be a tall woman with big boobs. <laughs> I can't let myself, I'm so stupid. God was just like, yeah, you're gonna be tall and you're gonna have big boobs. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> but we know he ain't died. Like, come on now. So he what? What he about to do? He about to go home and chill? <laughs> he goes home and just chills over on Sunday rock. That's a really good question. I mean,
Of course they are. But it's all going according to his plan or some shit, right? It has to be. He wants you to get close to them so that, you know, when it's time, he's slowly going to kill them one by one, right? That has to be it. Oh, fuck, um... Well, that's a good question because I can't even recall the last movie I saw in theater either. And that had to be before the pandemic. Hmm? Oh, your one's pretty. Yeah! <laughs> Honestly, I can too. Because you guys like have so much in common. A little bit, not that much though. Seriously, wait, what if he had something to do? Oh, oh shit, damn. Are you hungry? Yeah. <laughs> well, you'll eat anything, right? Uh huh. Mm, okay. I feel sick. No. <laughs> oh my god! And he's gone. <laughs> he probably went home.
mind if you try to put it on a meter code? <laughs> Can I just mm, that neck like hook? Huh. He would be the one. <laughs> Yeah, she's really lively when she's trying. <laughs> really? Yeah, your mom is definitely like a laid back type person, but... That's why I really, really, really want an episode on his parents. Or at least something. You know, still I'm pissed the fact his grandpa was very close to saying something and then he died. <laughs> oh, fuck Junpei. Have to kill him. True. See, that scares anyone. God, he's just so innocent. I can't imagine him killing anybody. He... 
Go, yeah, because you got knocked out after drinking. How much did you drink? That is disgusting. Disgusting. Gross. Nah, because, you know, if I saw him, like, <laughs> just kill it. Oh, God, please tell me she's not going to die. If only she didn't wake up. Right. You can't always put your emotions in the way. Possibly. You're not going to have him eat that, though. Mm, I could have been anybody. Like, I don't want him to think that, you know, Yuji had anything to do with this because he's innocent. Oh my god, he's an ass. The hell? Um. <laughs> See, that'd be the one day I wouldn't be going to school! <laughs> So, yeah. 
here, did I? Well, that makes sense. But the fact that they would both go that far just to kill Junpei's mom, but... Yeah, no mother really survives an anime. They always fucking die. There are some, but not all. Oh, but you will be. Oh. Oh, are you about to kill him? Oh my god, Jupe! <laughs> Unfortunately, it's too late for that. If you only came a couple of minutes after. No, you don't. You motherfucker. You motherfucker. You are fuckers. You are bitches. No. What the fuck? It was getting good. I was ready for Junpei to make his first kill. Like, oh my god. Like, let's go. Even though his mom, he, she did. Rest in peace her soul. She wouldn't have been proud about that. But still, like, he needs this even though he's corrupted. Because he thinks it's the dude who's getting his ass. But it's not. It's the people who he trusts. You never trust bad, bad guys. I mean, especially, like, mm -hmm. hot bad guys. <laughs> But if you would have told me at the beginning of this episode that basically his mom was just going to be in this episode just to die, I would have looked at you like you were nuts. Because I'm thinking like, oh, she'll be fine. But I get the reason of why they did that because they need to set a fire in his belly and for him to start possibly killing. Almost like, you know, with Aaron and the Titans or any other anime protagonist who has had a parent unfortunately die and then that lets so light something in their belly and they're like, you know, zero to sixty. Just go. But oh God. Are these two about to duke it out next week? I mean mm, honestly your girl right to see that. Like I really thought he was gonna kill his teacher though cause if he killed his teacher I wouldn't have had no problem with it <laughs> I just like I don't want these two to fight, but I get the fact that they have to now because of what the fuck happened in this episode. But, like, goddamn it. Like, I, I wanted it to be like Mateo would have told Junpei to just stay close to Yuji no matter what and become really close friends with him. And then that's when they strike without, you know, not killing his mom yet or any other person who Junpei has been in contact with, including his teacher, um, the kids who bullied him, even though all three of those are dead, then plus the dude he's about to kill now. And any other, like, really good student or just a random student or person that came in contact with him. And then, like, yeah, 
instantly kill him like that. But like, oh god, like I, I don't know. I, I want it to be next Friday so bad. Between this and freaking Don Machi and the way those two episodes have ended, like y'all can't leave me like this with cliffhangers. I'm real. Your girl hates cliffhangers. I've hated cliffhangers for the longest time, and I hate when it gets so freaking good, and then it's like. Nope, you gotta wait till next week. And y'all literally just, like, saying fuck you to me. And I don't like it. Huh, I just, I'm ready to see this fight. Just to see how this is gonna play out. What our emotions gonna be at play. Because the fact is, you know, do I want Yuji to make a first kill by next week? I'll say maybe. But he has to put his emotions aside. His emotions... I'm not going to say are making him weak, but it makes him hesitate. And I think there's going to be a time where he is going to have to choose between emotions and killing someone. And you don't want your emotions to get in your way because if that gets in your way, that is going to clearly fuck you over. And you might be the one who's going to die instead of the person you're trying to kill. And then you'll have no one to blame but yourself. Yes, it it's going to be traumatizing because I've seen other characters, whether it's animes and games or in movies or in TV shows, having to do their first kill and being very, like, PTSD in later seasons or in episodes. But I get it. And maybe if that does happen, they show it well I don't know because it, it, it's not every PTSD type moment is the best for some shows that I've seen but you never know we gotta know until next week but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Jujutsu Kaisen if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the Marshall Squad and of course I will see you guys officially y'all next Friday for episode 12 bye guys